Hey, what's going on guys? Clickwood here back again, bringing you guys another head-to-head -head seasons game here on Madden 15 Ultimate Team. We are currently 1-0 on the season. You guys saw the video previously to this one. We went, we won the game 21-10. to Pretty convincing fashion. Um, you know, not really like my best game or anything, but not too bad. We're going to try and make a run at the playoffs this season, guys. I haven't been in the playoffs in quite a while in playing head-to-head -head seasons games. It's pretty much been since I got to the All Madden division. I just haven't been able to get to the playoffs. So, I mean, thankfully, I haven't been demoted. But let's get into this game, guys, as we're going to bomb this thing down the field. Calvin Johnson with the face catch. Hey, you know what? I, I know. I, I hate streaks. I hate the fact that that's in this game. But at a certain point, man, when these people just run single coverage on your giant receivers, your ultimate legend wide receiver, six foot five guys, you have to throw the ball up for him eventually and try and make a play on it. And we're able to do it there. Another pass here to Calvin Johnson, getting the ball down to about the four yard line here. Very effective first drive here. Lots of Calvin Johnson, as you can imagine. We're going to go to him one more time here. Oh, Calvin. He drops that one. Same play to the opposite side. Julio Jones is going to drop this one as well on third down, which means we do end up having to settle here for a field goal. Probably could have tried to go for it there. My offense was moving pretty well. But I, you know what? I just want to take my points here. I don't want to make any dumb plays. My opponent there throwing that thing directly into double coverage. Can't believe that we didn't knock that thing down at the very least or get an interception. I can't believe he caught it. That's just craziness. But, uh, you know, my opponent's going to make some throws like that in this game that are questionable. This one, a very good one, though. Second and seven gets a little bit robbed there as we knock him down. Third and seven now, and he's going to pass this thing over the middle. A lot of crossing patterns from this guy. Uh, that's that's kind of the thing that I noticed. He, he kept trying to go to those crossing patterns. That one, we are going to knock away as well. Ronnie Lott just laying the boom on these guys and knocking the ball out of their hands. But uh, he is going to complete that one there, third and six. Another questionable throw, kind of into coverage, but he is going to be able to pick up the first down there. First and ten here, and look at Andre Ellington off the edge with a nice run. He's definitely mixing things up here. A lot of, uh, you know, the, the crossing patterns, like I said, with the passing game. But he's running the ball quite a bit as well, which a lot of people kind of, you know, once they see their passing game working, they kind of give up on the run. This guy, though, was continuing to run the ball for the most part. Uh, but still, those crossing patterns were the big thing that was driving him down the field. He's going to go for one one more time here down to about the one yard line he's able to call a timeout here he ran so much clock out here we did make two stops there on first and second down uh, but it was not quite enough there so man he, we had just almost no time left less than 20 seconds left when we got the ball back here at the end of the first half but he's running straight up prevent defense here very questionable decision because what I'm trying to do here is not score a touchdown. I'm trying to get into field goal position and he's going to allow me to do it here as we get down here to about the 35 yard line with Mike Ditka and we are going to kick this field goal here with time expiring here in the first half. So we are down six to seven going into the second half. Not the end of the world though. Um, you know, it definitely could have been worse. My opponent's back on offense now and he's going to throw another one into coverage there. Ronnie Lott not going to get the interception, but he does swat it down. Very next play, another crossing pattern. Ronnie Lott lays the hammer one more time. Brings up now a third and 10. This is a big play here. We got to try and make a stop. And we are going to get the user pick. Gotcha, bitch. Luke Keekly undercuts that thing, and he is going to score a touchdown on it as well. Huge play, ladies and gentlemen, as we go for two now to try and make it a seven-point game. But yeah, my right tackle and right guard didn't even block anybody on that play. If you go back and watch the replay, they literally just stood there while guys ran past them. So that's always nice. That's just, that's just Madden for you this year. <laughs> anyway, though, we are up five here, so we're doing okay. We just got to try and make a stop here. This is a big drive. My opponent's running the clock out so much right now. And look at his running game. He's mixing things up. I got to give him credit. He is running the ball very, very effectively here. Um, not any huge gains, but definitely plenty of decent yardage. Three, four, five yards a pop. And it's very, very difficult to stop that when your opponent is committed to running the ball like this. Andre Ellington off the edge again. And guys, like I said, his offense wasn't really anything spectacular. That spin move was pretty nice. Though. I got to give him credit. But uh, the big thing was that he was kind of just throwing me off because I'm so used to everybody trying to pass the ball. So as we get down here into the red zone, I'm going to commit a little bit more on stopping the run, and it's going to work out for us here as we make that first down stop. Second down stop here as well. Brings up a third down. This is a big play. We obviously know he's got a pass, and we get the sack there. Blitzing guys off the edge. Ronnie Lott with another huge play. Fourth down. He is going to go for it, and we knock it away with Calvin Johnson free safety. So we're back on offense now. Pretty much just need to get one more first down, and we win this game. We do throw a two-yard pass there to Bruce Miller, and no, that's not your screen lagging guys that was actually in the game my opponent paused it 
I'm pretty sure he yanked out his internet cable because a few seconds later, we're gonna get this little message here, the please wait thing, and then we get this popping up on the screen. The connection to your peer has been lost. So I'm feeling pretty good. We've obviously got the win here, uh, 12 to seven. A good performance for us in this one, right? Well, we go back to the menu here uh, and we didn't have to restart or anything like that. And here's what I saw, one and one. Yeah, we got a loss for that game. This game is so screwed up. It's unbelievable. I, I just have no words. Even when I win, I still lose. This game is unreal. But hopefully you guys enjoyed the video. If you did, please be sure to hit the like button. Of course, if you're new, please subscribe to the channel. That's how we grow this thing. Thank you so much. Hope you guys enjoyed it. And I'll talk to you again soon.